I used to be on top of the world, brother. All pro quarterback, four years running. Voted the sexiest Texan in 2004. Yeah, man, I beat out Dennis Quaid and Matthew McConaughey, for Christ's sake. Yeah, so I drank a few beers now and then, popped the occasional pill. That's nothing compared to what the team quacks would shoot me up with just so I could play. And yeah, sometimes I just need to numb the pain, you know what I'm saying? My biggest vice was speed. No, not meth, buddy, adrenaline. I blew every penny I had on the fastest cars I could find. Just so you know, I'm a damn good driver. If that asshole I was street racing hadn't sideswiped me, I never would have crashed. And that, uh, that poor girl would still be alive. That's right. That's right. It's his goddamn fault. I shattered my leg in six goddamn places. So I had a few drinks in me. So what the fuck? I drive drunk better than I do sober anyway. Of course, I couldn't play worse shit after that. After I got out of jail, I canned my ass. I'd have violated the morals clause on my goddamn contract. Ended up playing semi-pro in fucking Canada. <sighs> But I'm still a name. Oh yeah, I'm still a celebrity. That's why they wanted me to promote their blood drive here. That's why they fucking flew me, first class, halfway around the goddamn world. Because my name still means something. Logan Carter is no goddamn douchebag. <laughs>